12 18 on your Tuesday. Sam couldn't ask for a better day. I know we're looking at warmer temperatures today, but some rain in sight in the coming days. Yes, yeah, some rain's going to be moving into the area later on this week, Brooke. In fact, the remnants of Francine are the reason why it's going to be a pretty rainy end to the week and heading right out into the weekend. A pretty good weekend to grab a good book or maybe just binge a movie or show if you can. Uh, it's going to be kind of a drearier, cool weekend along with that chance for rainfall. But in the meantime, we're just staying sunshine filled. Get out and enjoy that sun while you can. Yesterday at Ali International, we clipped 82 and later on throughout the course of late last night, early this morning, uh, the mid 50s was the coolest we dropped down to at the airport. And so far we've been hovering at 78 at Ali International as we've gotten into the lunch hour. Lanesville sitting at 76 degrees today. And all in all, it will be a quiet remainder of the day today. And frankly, all of midweek will be quiet. I uh, noticed that east and southeast wind flow outside. We do have some pretty dry air still underway for the remainder of Kentucky in us. So today, 87, likely the high temperature. Our sunset just before 8 p.m. So, of course, we're continuing to lose about two and a half minutes of daylight per day, progressing into the remainder of late summer. It's going to be a quiet, warm midweek. In fact, we're going to be striking the 90s tomorrow afternoon, uh, getting near 90 today, although some mid 80s outside of Louisville. End of week rainfall, you know, for the remnants of Francine, like I just mentioned. And so far, the rainfall tracker does have the first couple of bands from Francine moving through into Thursday evening and uh, late Thursday night. Friday into Saturday morning is also looking to be the main timeline of some heavier bouts of rainfall as well. Now, regionally, we're staying really quiet with this big old ridge of high pressure continuing to stir in sunshine filled air, light wind, low humidity. But you look down to the south right now. This is where Francine is really gaining strength. The Gulf of Mexico waters are extremely warm right now, so there's a lot of energy for Francine to be working with, and we're noticing some bands of heavier showers and a brief rumble of thunder from New Orleans and just south of the Louisiana coastline from Corpus Christi towards Brownsville, Houston included. So Francine will be making more of a northeasterly trajectory and track. And right now, the National Hurricane Center does have Francine as a Category 1 hurricane striking uh, the Louisiana coastline with the Gulf of Mexico. There could be some updates in the near future, though, that do bring it in as a Category 2 hurricane as it makes landfall with Louisiana. So we're watching the tropics very closely, and the tropical storm will be impacting western Kentucky and bringing bouts of rainfall locally into Friday and the weekend. So luckily today and tomorrow staying sunshine filled. We need the rainfall though. Keep in mind we're finally going to be seeing that as we get into Thursday night. Thursday, a sharp increase in clouds. We're going to be going from clear sky Wednesday night to kind of a partly cloudy sky Thursday morning. Those high passing clouds will give way to some thicker clouds throughout the evening hours on Thursday. The latest Futurecast model update does show temperatures Thursday evening in the 70s and there will be some bands of heavier rain pushing in. So the timing right now looks to be beyond sunset Thursday night through basically the late night hours on Friday and some of this rainfall even into Friday morning could be a bit hefty in some spots. In fact, right now the rainfall forecast is about an inch per or two inches here in Louisville. Heavier totals could be found down to the south. So again, we're going to be watching the evolution of uh, Francine very closely. But in the meantime, Friday and Saturday look to be rainy and we're going to climb to 91 tomorrow after reaching 87 today.